happy early fall you guys i'm so glad that you guys found my channel today if you are new here welcome glad you're here if you're my returning subbies so glad that you guys are rocking with your girl this far i love you all so so much so today but we're going to be decorating for fall i cannot wait because this is one of my favorite seasons so let me tell you i am ashley i do mom content seasonal decorations vlogs which is lifestyle some travel here and there all of the things because you know as women we love all of the things so here in this clip i'm just showing you guys the items that i will be using in this video these are all new items that i found this year i did not spend a lot I did not go to a whole lot of stores. I mainly went to Dollar Tree, Dollar General, and Hobby Lobby. But I like to show you guys what I'll be using so you'll get a good visual of what everything looks like, what the color scheme is looking like. Even though I don't really know exactly where I'm going, but these are just some items that I've really loved and liked and I just picked up because I felt like they did kind of go with some of the colors I may want to go with. I really don't want to go with a lot of deep oranges and reds. These are some items that I have from the last two years and I just got a good collection right now. I really wanted to kind of get rid of some things but at this moment I don't really know if I want to get rid of anything because I could use outdoors or in other areas of my home. But we're going to be using some things out of this box along with what we have on the table. I would love to show you guys what I'll be using and I like to give you guys a glimpse of what my house looks like in the state it is before we bring fall into it. So here I'm just kind of going through showing you guys some colors, some different things that I have, what I may be using and different things. So just stick around, get you a good drink, cozy up, put this on your TV and kick back and just enjoy because this is going to be a great fall decorate video and I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed doing it and bringing the inspiration to you guys if you aren't motivated yet I hope after this you will feel motivated and pumped to get started in your home
I love starting over here in this corner. I don't know if it just gives me, you know, a good eye for how to continue with my decorating, but I love decorating this corner. It's always the first thing I tend to decorate. I just love when I'm at the sink or in another like part of the house which would be probably the living room or eating at the table you can just look in that corner and it's just a cute little space that always catches my eye so I think that's why I do enjoy decorating it first here I'm going in to cozy up the space with this old lamp I had in my office when I used to work on site I kept this lamp I pulled it from my living room on top of a stand and brought it here in the kitchen and I put it on that cake stand I mean I have other stands but for some reason while I was about to move it I decided to keep that stand there and just decorate it use it for the lamp holder and then I'm gonna add some little pumpkins or in different whatnots here this is like a little vignette corner I found these little books here from Dollar Tree I thought they were super cute but this space although I love decorating it it also was kind of difficult for me to decorate it this time I don't know I didn't know really where I wanted to go what I was colors I really wanted some of the colors were kind of throwing me off so just keep watching you guys Although I really wanted to use this candle because of all the leaves and the fall colors, I really just felt like it was just a little too busy for the space being that the books were already, you know, had color and then all my other things were pretty much neutral with a touch of black. I just didn't know if I wanted to do that busy candle. So I'm just going to have to keep playing around with that space like I said. Happy Saturday and happy fall decorating again today. So you guys, I didn't finish last night because I just was not sure if I really liked how I set it up. So I kind of went back through some of my stuff to see what I could use, what colors I could, you know, put in that stem because what's throwing me off is that white. This, this is throwing me off. It's like, I don't know if it's this and all the greenery, which I like the greenery. Because I feel like it's still warm and it's really not fall yet. This is kind of like preparing for fall. You know you have to get your content out there for inspiration. So I give you guys time enough to get, and get some ideas and get your vision together to see what you would like to put in your space. But so far, a lot of my stuff I've been using was things that I already had around my home except you know i showed you guys a little bit of the stuff that i picked up here and there for this season but a lot of the stuff i'm using is things i already had thank god because i don't need any more stuff so i'm gonna work on changing this either popping this out or putting something over it so i don't know if i want to keep this here either like maybe slide this over some maybe put this over there not sure but we're going to play around with it a little bit more right now and then we're going to get back into the decorating so come on you guys
I love this picture. I decided to bring it back out. I purchased it the year before and I used it in my dining room video, but it's just the perfect color and added touch to my kitchen decorate video. I just had to put it back up. Love how it looked. The saying is so true, fall is proof that change is beautiful. That is a very true statement. Couldn't agree any better. This wooden pumpkin I found last year from Big Lots. It has the monogram initial. I actually feel like I want to cover the base of the stand. So I do have some little stems, picks laying around that I'm just gonna work with and play with and see how I like it. So you'll see me just trying to tie different colors into this pumpkin stand to see what goes and what flows with those little books that i found at dollar tree they look like stacked books you guys so cute and those came from the dollar tree a dollar 25 this orange little leaf i felt like it would have went with the leaf that's in the picture but it's a little bit too orangey red for me so i think i'm just gonna leave the yellow i believe but let's just see what we come up with Pretty late. I spent the week thinking about her. Next day, it was easier than so much easier than. Oh, like that time I picked you up outside of school. You said, "Screw my dad, I make my own rules." It was easier than so much easier than. Take me back to the. Take me back to those easy summer days when we stopped at nothing, baby. Yeah, we stopped at nothing, baby. They couldn't take us, they couldn't change us, they couldn't catch us if they tried. Now we didn't care at all about winter or spring or fall. We felt so alive and girl, we were thriving on kisses and sunshine and mischief. Yeah, we had. Moving along to this corner, I'm going to be decorating this stand with three shelves. This shelf is usually, these shelves are usually pretty, pretty easy to work with. So what I'm doing is just taking away all of my summer items. I'm going to really be reusing everything that I have, probably except the picture, but everything I'm going to repurpose. I like to store my summer items away, especially the ones that I feel like I'm going to use again. I will put them away and then just redecorate for the new season in something new. I'm just placing these neutral cream pumpkins in this bowl as a filler. I wanted to keep this space kind of muted and neutral as possible because what I'm going to do with my table is very close in the same vicinity and I just wanted everything to tie together. So I'm just keeping the tones kind of muted and neutral. Here I'm just going to set my table. I've decided to go back with my mats that I keep on here all the time. I'm using my black plates that I've had for years from Dollar Tree. I just felt like with this space and also that this space is kind of cold adhesive with my living room i just felt like black with neutral and a touch of white would just be a perfect pop that i needed bought these little cute pumpkins last year from walmart after the fall season and those 
white pumpkins i found those at the dollar tree this year and i could only find two and i was like i'm just gonna improvise girl guys because i'm using them mm -hmm. and they got the little wood stem on them that goes exactly with the little wood look of the pumpkins that i found at walmart the previous year so just be creative you don't have to be matchy matchy and i'm tying everything in together with this vase with this flower piece that i found at burlington last season it's like some pompous grass with a little bit of white and i got these leaves last year i believe just some picks that i found after the fall season that i'm placing in here because i want to keep it kind of muted also so i love how everything came out i really love this
think of the video hope you guys enjoyed it if you did i would love to hear your feedback in the comment section please don't forget to do all the things that other youtubers tell you to do like share with a good friend and subscribe i love to have you over here now really quick i did the video i enjoyed doing it i hope if you aren't inspired or haven't been inspired or motivated i hope you got that push and that boost that you needed to get started in your home so until next time guys, I'll see you in the next one.